Well, today is day 21. And this morning we had two baby chicks hatch. And this guy just came out of the shell within the last hour. It's about 11 o'clock in the afternoon right now. See, this is the guy that was out this morning. He's pretty feisty. And... Oh, here he comes. There's lights disturbing him and noise. There's one in the back over here. Cam I can't get him on the camera. So we have one, two. Looks like three so far. And oh, here he comes. You can see that color eggshell that this guy's coming out of. Those are what they call the Easter eggs. And I wanted a couple of these because I only have one hen left that lays those eggs. And now it looks like I have one. Two of those eggs might have hatched. And the other one's a brown egg, so that one will be laying brown eggs. Maybe. We'll see. Now a couple of these eggs went in a little later. They were about a day or two apart. Today's day 21 for some of these. So we have three so far. And I'm going to get the slide away and leave them alone. But this other guy back here, he's an active one. I'll wait until later tomorrow and take these guys out and put them into the uh, rearing box. At first, I'm just going to put them into a cardboard box, set it up with the heat lamp, the food and water. And as they get a little bigger, I'll put them into a bigger box. And now we'll just leave them alone. We'll be back later to see if anybody else joins the pack. Okay, today we're taking our new arrivals from the incubator to the to the brooder. Johnny, take the lid off, and let's see who's ready to come out. Okay, okay, let's see. Um, this guy's all, this guy's all fluffy. Johnny, get this one here. Okay, put him in. Nice and easy. Okay. Okay, Cora, let's see. How's this guy look? We want to make sure they're dry. If they're wet, they got to stay in here. Okay, you can take this one out. Atta girl. Nice it's and okay. easy. Yeah, don't put it near your face. You can put its head. Rub its head. Okay, put it in there. Thank you. Okay. You're next. You're back. Okay, let's see. Uh, get that, that fluffy one over there. Yeah, get that. That's the first one. That was the first one hatched. Okay, where are we here? Now Johnny. Okay. All right. Okay, let's see. We're going to take any of these out. Oh, look, these guys are out already. This guy may be escaped. Yeah, look at that. This one and the other one that looks like it was from Big Red. The Americana chicken. I only have one. And these, and these two right here hatched from these two eggs. I have one more egg like that. It looks like it's ready to come out. So guys, we have to get this done quick because we have to keep, keep the heat on here to let the other ones hatch. Okay, you know, mm -hmm. take that one right there. Oh, that's a noisy one. Now hold them good, hold them good. Now hold her. Let's hope they're all hers. Oh, grandma wants to give it a rub. Okay, there you go, all right. Uh, get that one that's loose back in. That was the uh, that one was hatched yesterday. I know because that one has a piece of shell still attached to it. <laughs> okay, put it in there. Should I take the shell off? No, I get it because I have to introduce them to the food and to the water. Okay, Grandpa. Okay, and let's see. We got another one left in here. Yeah, get this. Uh, is this one dry? Oh, yeah, he's nice and dry. Okay, let's get that one in there. Come on, get it in there. There we go. Now I need you to put the lid back on 
because this one looks like we might have another one. We might have number seven. Wait, you know what? Let's get these out of here. We don't need this in here. Okay. This one looks like it might be common, and these two went in late. Oh, one more. Good job. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. Sorry. And there's water in there. Okay. Can hit that. Put it out the side. Okay, doing a good job. Hit the switch over there. Turn that power back on. Okay, I shut it off so nobody got burnt. Now, I have to introduce them to the water and to the feed. Okay, well, could you hold this camera for me? Just hold it steady on there. And, oh, John, you know what I did? Let me get some water. Could you go get some water for me? And I'm going to fill up the feed. You can get a little Let me get this because this is messy. And once again, we turned my office into a, a hatchery. Show them where the water is so they know i'll put that other bottle in after hey john get that light shine that light in there turn that light on shine it on okay okay so we got to get them one at a time see how we do this nick we got to get their beacon there i think yep i see okay I see. is the camera picking that up mm -hmm. okay here's in another one <laughs> oh you can move the camera around you know Okay, there we go. Thank you. Because they never drank before. This is a, this is their first drink. I if, hope they're enjoying it because they yeah, must be the, pretty thirsty. It's their first Wait, night out. No, 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 not this. When they get a little bigger, you guys can handle them. Today's the first day they came out of the incubator. Okay. They're, they're not used to that. No, they're not used to anything. Yeah, say she's drinking already. She says they're thirsty. These two. Ooh, ooh. There you go. Are those special okay. chickens? Um, they're oh, the ones that make so the color cute. eggs. Let me have the feed of it. You hold the light, John. Hold it steady. Okay, now let's get them used to this feeder over here because they got to learn how to eat too. Once they learn how to eat, let me tell you, they're like vultures. They don't stop. Now they're only going to be in here a couple of days because this is warmer than the other one I have. Can you get them in here? Right? Yeah, okay, we got that way. Okay, let me go this way. Okay, get your head in there. Yeah, get your head in there. Let's go. I wasn't sure if those triangles were big enough, but it looks like it's plenty big. Hopefully, it's not as much waste as what we had before. Come on, you. Yeah, okay. Not too anxious now. You will be in a day. Another day, you'll be anxious. There's that one with the shell. Yeah. Be careful. It's it's not even stuck. It's just on there. Oh. Okay, there you go. Come on. So you're not getting me in that box. Okay, I think I got them all. Did I get them all, guys? Yeah. Except yeah. that one. That one. Okay. Want to hold the camera on it for a little bit? Just. Oh. Uh, yeah. Put it so you can. So you have to, just hold it like that so you can hold it stay. Okay. Yeah, and they might have another one coming soon. There's, yeah, a, there's another. Is it one of the red? I think they're red. Okay, watch, watch, watch. Okay, okay, Johnny. The light does no good over there. Over here, Nick, you hold the light. Johnny, okay. you give me that water that you have. Walk around there. Don't trip on anything. Give me that water, please. Thank you. Okay, let's get that water in here. You didn't have to go under it because it's right behind him. Yeah. Okay. Let me put that. And I got 
try the red because I knew we were going to get some. Put your finger over here, John. Like hold it with a knob. No, no. Put your finger. Go like this. Like this. Like this. Like this. Hold it. 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 Like the legs are okay, huh, John? Yep. We don't Can have we... that, sp like the other one, remember she had the spade legs? Yeah. We don't. There's a, there's a chicken that, um. Okay, catch up. He's over here. Didn't it break its leg and it died? No, it didn't break its leg. The legs. Just didn't work? Yeah, they didn't work right now. Okay. Oh, I really want to hold on. Can you hold no. on? Okay, that's enough. Everybody. Mm -hmm. right. Well, guys, that's it for now. If you want to see how you can stop. Well, guys, that's it for now. If you want to see how you can get this set up with practically no cost, just watch this till the end. Pull the camera like away. As I mentioned earlier in the video, you don't need a lot to get started. This is a, a chest that Italian ices get delivered in, and it's thrown out. It's discarded. I picked this up for another purpose, but... Uh, about a year or so ago, I converted it to uh, an incubator. And what I did was get a light socket. I connected it to a thermostat. And this thermostat came off of uh, a water heater, a discarded water heater. I was having a little difficulty getting it to hit temperature. But once I, once I was able to get temperature with it, it maintained the temperature. It would come on when it got cool, and it would go off when it got warm. It worked fairly well. I started a video of it, but unfortunately, it was one of the videos that pieces of it were missing, and I never posted it online. And then I just had a metal rack on the bottom where I had a water tray underneath. Now, today, I'm going to be using this as a brooder. What I did, I washed it out well. I put this piece of cardboard on the bottom. I'm going to put some paper in here. This is just to keep the chicks in here for a couple of days. The weather's been getting warm now. It's been in the 40s, the 50s, but at night, we did have nights just recently that went down to 17 and 15 degrees. So I know it'll stay warm in here for a couple of days, and then I have a bigger brood I could put them in. And what I did, I made this feeder out of a cardboard box. I was gonna turn it the other way so it was all white. But you can see it was just an old shoe box, Studio 19 something or another, I don't know what it was there. But I put it up, made a little lip on the bottom to give it a little bit of height. This side, I made the holes a little bigger. This side, a little smaller. I don't know. I don't know what size will actually work. But this should work until they get a little bigger. And as far as the water, I had something different the first time on the first batch of chickens I had. This is a coffee container that I cut. I made the lip. Uh, that's about three quarters just shy of three quarters of an inch and I have this jar you can use a soda bottle this happens to be a peanut jar I put some holes on the bottom and if you're doing this you want to make these holes on the bottom I'm holding the camera so I can't point to them but you can see those holes on the bottom you want to make those holes lower than the lip and when you fill this with water the water is only going to go as high as those holes now these holes happen to be a little lower because on the bottom of this container I don't know if the camera picks it up there is a little bit of a bevel and it pushes it up and you see these rubber bands here I just knocked this one off and I have these rubber bands here because the chicks are young one's uh, just about two days old and the others were hatched just uh, yesterday morning 
So I have this across so they don't lay in and then drown. And that's all it is for now. There was no cost to this container. Obviously no cost to this. Oh, and I have the string to tie this container in so it doesn't tip over. Because when they get moving, they'll be knocking things all around. So the thermostat, I did buy one. And I still have it in the packaging. But then I found this water heater and I pulled it out of the water heater. But the thermostat, I believe if you want to buy one of these, they're like $6. These uh, light bulb holders, I don't know what they are. This thing's ancient. I had it forever. And an extension cord that probably came off a microwave or something, a refrigerator that I cut it off of. You could get this project started for very few dollars. It doesn't take much to get it going. Once you start going, if you see you're into it, there's all kinds of accessories you could buy. The sky's unlimited. That's a wrap for now. If you enjoyed this video, found it useful, have any comments to make, post them down below. Give it a like. And if you haven't done so already, be sure to subscribe. If you can hit that bell icon to get notified when I post new videos, it's a big help to the channel. And, and anything you should purchase through my Amazon link does help support the channel. Until next time, everyone, stay safe and stay well.